Well, parts of central Texas and the Brazos Valley did get a handful of some showers and storms today, and those are going to continue into the beginning of next week, mainly Sunday, Monday, perhaps Tuesday, still with those scattered showers around. That's going to keep us cooler, though, in the low 90s for tomorrow and Monday, right around 90 to 91. So that's definitely cooler. Maybe some temperatures we haven't seen in a while, but it's not going to last. There will be some more heat coming back by next week and in fact by Thursday, Friday, I think uh, we really will really will be back into those upper 90s. Now any activity that we have out there this evening, it's not going to last too much longer. Those showers and storms will be fading away shortly after um, the evening. Now future track does keep us entirely rain free by midnight. Uh, that may not entirely be the case, perhaps still a couple showers lingering by 11 p.m. or 12 a.m., but most of that will have be uh, when winding down by that time. Here's Sunday, and again, Sunday's kind of going to play out like today. We'll have some scattered showers and storms. Where exactly those are going to develop is pretty hard to pinpoint, but some uh, random pop-up activity is definitely expected for Sunday with perhaps some downpours and some maybe frequent lightning in some of these strongest cells, but severe weather is not anticipated. And here's Monday, which kind of does the same thing. This is part of why we're going to be cooler right around 90 to 91. Still some scattered showers in the area. Not everyone is going to get wet. Some places will stay completely dry, but some people could be stuck under some downpours for a little while. So that's good news for the heat index Sunday, Monday. We're not even going to see heat index of triple digits. That's been a little while since that's happened, but by uh, Tuesday and Wednesday, as things begin to warm up again, uh, it's really going to start feeling hot outside in addition to that humidity. So 90 tomorrow, I have that for both uh, Central Texas and the Brazos Valley, then 91 for Bryan College Station on Monday, 92 for Waco and Central Texas with some showers in the area. Pretty much all the rain is going to be leaving by Tuesday, perhaps sticking around on Wednesday, but that'll allow us to dry out in time for the end of the week and getting back up to those upper 90s.